Hey guys, we're back. Um, I don't know what happened to our other video, but we lost connection. Our Wi-Fi mustn't be real good out here. Hopefully, we're able to get this one done. Maddie, she's been training on these little guys, and um, these babies are the ones that are remaining available out of Hazel and Willow's litter. So that little girl over there is, um, well, let's talk about the one that she's working with right now. This is little boy, and his name is Apollo. And he is a tiny little guy. He, I don't know, he'll probably be 10 to 15 pounds, I would say. Um, he's going to have a plush coat, and he's just a little sweetheart. He loves to cuddle, so actually, it's pretty amazing that he's not on Maddie's knee right now. Right, Maddie? <laughs> but as you can see, Maddie's been working with them and teaching them how to sit. Hey, buddy, come to see me. And how to spin. And uh, she even had little Miss uh, Abby here. She had her laying down here a little bit ago. She would taught her to lay down already. Uh, Pomskis are extremely smart, at least ours are. And uh, we love to teach them tricks and teach them to do new things. See, she's just about to lay down. Uh, can you get it done, Maddie? So, nope. That's it. Good. So close. So close. Oh, her little butt popped up. <laughs> so this is Miss Abby. And she is a blue, rare blue Pomsky. She has one blue eye and one probably is going to be a green eye, I would say, like her mom, or like her grand, her aunt, uh, or else maybe like a hazel color. We're not sure. Um, do you think there's going to be any blue in that, that one eye? Not that one, but the other one? What do you think? No, I don't think so either. I think it's going to be like a greenish or hazel color, probably. So she is still looking for her new home. I estimate that Abby's probably going to be around the same size as her mom, which is about 20 pounds. <laughs> Abby said, I probably had enough cheese now. When you're training Pomskis, um, your best bet when they get a little older is to take them for a little walk and then go ahead and work on training them. So they've got that energy worked out of them and they're ready to focus. Um, these little guys here, of course, they're not too full of energy quite yet, but so they'll, they're, they do just fine, just working right into training them. This little girl here is Brookita, and she is a woolly little baby. It can't be on my arm, Abby, or else you will make everybody sick that's watching the video, okay? We can cuddle later, okay? All right, Abby. And little Rakita is a woolly little girl. She is a spitting image of her mom, Willow. I mean, their markings are exactly the same. I don't know about their eye color yet. We've tried to figure out whether she's going to have uh, the hazel greenish color that her mother has or if her eyes are gonna be brown. And I'm just not gonna call it because, um, can you move him, Maddie? He's trying to get my camera. Um, at different times, I can see blue in her eyes, and then I can see some green in her eyes. So I can't, I can't say how much they're going to change. I know her mother at this age did have eyes just like this. So I'm assuming. Um, and if you were interested in finding out more, I can send you pictures of Willow's eyes. They're just incredibly. Uh, unique really so that is miss Brakita, and she is going to have a woolly coat and uh, just an adorable little girl aren't you hmm? yeah just letting me talk about you aren't you hmm? just happy to be here hmm? <laughs> you got some cheese stuck underneath your in your fur <laughs> um and then mid little mr apollo he has a really unique kind of cinnamon colored coat but it has like a little bit of an orange tinge to it uh, foxy color 
look at her still laying there. <laughs> She's like, okay, I guess nobody got the clue that I wanted my belly scratched still. Um, but little Apollo is a tiny, tiny little guy. Look at him. He is so cute. He has a little bit of blue in his, oh, in his um, eyes and a little bit of green. So I'm not sure what they're going to be. I know when we did the flash test when he was um, three weeks old, they did flash red eyes. So I would assume that they're probably going to be a hazel eye and maybe a part partly blue in his eyes. But he is a little cuddler. He loves to be on your lap and loves to be cuddled and um, just a little sweetheart. Thank you. Oh, yes you are. Yes you are. You <laughs> Abby says, what about me? What about me? <laughs> you're a smart little one, aren't you? Really? I'm a savvy. Hey, you're picking up on those tricks real quick, aren't you? Yeah. We are located in southern Iowa, and uh, we do fly our puppies. We work with a great group of puppy nannies, and so they make all the arrangements, and they pick up the puppy from the airport from me and deliver it right to the airport that they can fly into that's near you and it works out pretty good. We live on a farm in southern Iowa and we have Madison that is 14. That's her. And then we have Mr. Drew, he's 12. And we homeschool both our kids. So in the morning we do school and in the afternoon we have to go to work. And that includes playing with little adorable puppies like you. Right? Yeah. <laughs> It's a tough job. It's a rough job, isn't it? It's a tough, rough job. Huh? Little Abby. Huh? Both these girls are a rare blue color. And um, so not too many Pomsky breeders are able to produce that yet. So that's why these girls are a little more expensive and they are just rare right now. This little girl, she's gonna be a woolly, where Abby, I think she's gonna be a longer plush, probably, probably just a plush coat. <laughs> Are you sitting on your brother? What, do you hear everybody barking out there? I know, I know, somebody came. Our dog alarms are going off. Oh, really? Oh. Okay, come cuddle. Look at little Miss Burkina. Just wanted help. <clears throat> if you are interested in learning more about these three puppies or about uh, the video we just did earlier, our five littler puppies that are just four weeks old, um, if you want more information on them, you can message me or even give me a call. I'd love to visit with you. Um, if you uh, want to find out more information on mom and dad and pictures of them, you can visit our website, which is www.mainaimranchdogs.com. And um, we have pictures of mom and dad, and uh, we have um, all sorts of videos and stuff on there of, of uh, the parents and um, the DNA on these guys too, if you were interested in that, learning what the uh, colors are and stuff we have that on our page too so you can check that out and um, we always pray about where our puppies go so if you're interested um, you know just find out more information we'd love to visit with you well we're gonna cut this video short we want to take pictures of these little guys and then we want to take pictures of the puppies that are in this litter that have already found their new homes and, uh, and there's only so much daylight. <laughs> so God bless you all and have a great day.